Hey everyone, my name is Rob from Top Career Consulting, and on this channel I explain exactly how I established myself as a freelance writer and digital marketer and the tips and tricks that I learned along the way. So if that is something that interests you, please uh, consider subscribing down below, hit the bell notification so you receive all my uh, new videos as soon as I publish them, drop a like, leave a comment, I really want to know what information you're interested in learning so I can create those videos. I've broken down all this information into bite-sized chunks to share with you to make it really easy to grasp and put into practice. So last time we talked about four SEO tools that are great to use if you're just starting out. Today I have four more that are worth looking into. So having a good set of resources will definitely help you get off on the right foot when it comes to SEO copywriting. So number one, Keywords Everywhere. So Keywords Everywhere is a free Chrome extension that helps with keyword research. It shows related keywords and their search volumes on both Google and Bing. And there's a paid version of Keywords Everywhere, but the free version does all of the following. See related keywords and people also search for PASF terms, see YouTube insights and tags, analyze trend charts in Google and YouTube, analyze any URL to get a list of keywords and keyword density from that page, view monthly traffic estimates, view the top 5,000 keywords any URL ranks for. The paid version is extremely affordable at only $2 a month on average. I'd recommend starting with the free version and then scaling up if it's truly needed. Number two, is BuzzSumo, which is another great SEO tool to have in your arsenal. When you input the keyword, it displays relevant content that's gotten the most social media shares. This is a great tool for getting a sense of what people want to read and what they're engaging uh, with on social media. This information is valuable in SEO because our goal is to create content that people want to read. If your writing isn't connecting um, to what your audience wants to read, then you're wasting your time. So BuzzSumo shows what your audience engages with on social media, and having this knowledge can help you create similar content that reaches your clientele. Number three is Answer the Public. Answer the Public is a great SEO tool and it's totally free. It works by displaying questions around your topic that people are already Googling. It also suggests autocomplete searches. This is a great tool to use if you need to create content around specific keywords to rank better. Answer the Public provides invaluable insight about exactly what people are searching. It's one of the fastest and easiest ways to come up with new SEO topics for your site. Number four, Google Search Console. This is another free tool that you need to be aware of. Google Search Console helps measure your site's performance and search traffic. It also lets you monitor your presence on the SERP, which we've discussed before, Search Engine Results page. By verifying your website through Google Search Console, you can submit your sitemap for indexing. This gives you control of, over how your website is represented and what gets indexed. And these four SEO tools from today and the four we discussed last time give you a great place to start your research. Uh, these tools will help you with optimization, but you need to put in the work and to get the results you really want. It's gonna take some time, but we'll get there together. And as always, consider subscribing for more great SEO tips and tricks. And thanks for watching again. Leave a comment down below and let me know which SEO tools you've tried and which ones you've liked best. And I will see you next time. Thank you.